The library map? Oh, I see! See the exits? They're right across from each other. Straight path. If Shadow walked down the straight path, there's a way Espio and Shadow couldn't have seen one another. Looks like you'll have to point out where exactly on the map you mean. Where could Espio have been for Shadow to not see him? Maybe not. Yeah. Yeah. Interesting. That's where I was sitting reading my book. I can second this. When I returned from the saloon car, Espio was in the same spot. That confirms it then. See, Shadow and Espio couldn't have seen one another from this spot. Because a bookcase is in the way. There's no way Shadow could have seen Espio, or vice versa. Makes a lot of sense why you never mentioned Shadow's return, Espio. There's just no way you could have seen him. I apologize for losing my cool back there. I felt like I was grasping, despite telling the truth. Oof. <laughs> but I'm glad you all believed me now. Your alibi is in the most dead type, but I have no further point. Thank you for both answering all our questions. Well, we did it. Another pair of alibis validated. Too many locked doors to worry about, but I'm glad everything straightened itself on our end. Well, it straightened itself out in the end. Uh, well, I'm exhausted. I'm gonna crash here for a bit. These chairs are so comfy. Likewise, I could use a breather. Sadly, our work isn't done. I have plenty of questions for Rouge and especially Shadow. Oh, it seems that the door to the next car is open. Amy must have kept it open when she passed through earlier. That's our cue to leave. See you later, Vector and Espio. Give him heck. And if you need any meat chopped, say it away. I'll keep my perch sharp. Murderer on the loose. While doors keep getting locked. It pop goes pop. While our hero, sorry. At this point, I'm feeling pretty confident and our detective abilities. We're really doing this. Come on, Ampit, let's see what's next. Coming. On, on, on to the next one. You sure you don't want to stay and look at all the great books a little longer? The mystery calls. Okay, the investigation continues. Uh. <laughs> Casino car. All this stuff's getting heavy. I'll dump what I don't need. Oh, there you are. We have a lot to say to you. We've visited every car so far and everyone said they've seen you wandering around. High time you told us why. <laughs> <laughs> Look. What, what was the phrase that you... I don't remember. They made a fool out of you, Blue. Like, my, my. Talk about a warm welcome. Quick to the point, are you, darling? And I see you've brought the microwave master with you. Ah, uh, please don't let that be my legacy. Hold on a sec. That's what she's... Something like that. She's got a weird voice. Got like a sultry voice. Yeah, but and not really. Blaze, Blaze is like on... I mean, a monitor. Blaze... I uh, like. Yeah, okay. monitor. Uh, bah, 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 bah. Uh -huh. This is right. Folks have brought you up a lot. Care to explain? Uh. Lem Rouge, we're gonna need the help. Please. All right, I've been hunting for a treasure rumored to be stored here on the train. It's treasure? They certainly tell me anything about treasure in the interview. I'm part of the business tycoon, part purveyor of fine collectibles. I knew I had to find it. Tell him what it is. All right, well, it's a Fabergé kale egg. <laughs> wow, that does sound extravagant. Please don't, <laughs> but please don't tell me you accepted Amy's birthday invite only to find that egg. A woman can have multiple goals. I gave Amy her birthday present already, so everything's well taken care of. Broke in on the hunt immediately. 
I stayed here while she searched for the train cars for clues. Where's Blaze from? I don't know, she's a princess or something. Yeah. I deduced that the Fabergé K.O. egg is here. This train car looks the safe. That's cow. Cow. <laughs> Wait, so the treasure is real? It's actually here? What did you manage to find, Rouge? Oh, well, why don't you both take a look? I found the train's blueprints in the library car, with the safe code written right on it. A score of a lifetime. Who did that? Very <laughs> the train's blueprints? Please, Rouge, let us see that. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh. find us keep, sweetheart. Problem, we need your assistance. What kind of problem? <laughs> the elevator behind the security guard leads right to the room holding the Fabergé chow egg. <laughs> We're not getting anywhere without the guard's access card. We need a plan to get that card to use the elevator. And our chance, to success, our chance of success grows with everyone's help. Do you want us to help you steal the Fabergé chow egg? Please, you don't have a problem with this? I see no issue here. Sounds like a fine business venture. Ah, her law card must be influencing her decisions here. Either that or breaking the rules must be refreshing for a princess. Albert, do you have an opinion on this? Feeling is for squares. <laughs> Don't we want to put? Uh, <laughs> yeah. I think the only square here is you, Microwave Master. Oh. I must admit, that wasn't the coolest thing I've heard on stay. No, my cool and mysterious reputation is crumbling. <laughs> alright, alright, I'm in, I'll help. Well, I suppose if both Blaze and Ampit are in. Okay, let's get that Fabergé chow egg. <laughs> That's the ticket. Happy to have you both on the team. Now, we must plan. <laughs> the heist. Oh boy, what have we gotten ourselves into? Access to the Fabergé Chow Egg room is behind a locked elevator door. Security guard has the access card. Do we attack the guard, bribe the guard, or distract the guard? Yeah, we distract them, right? Yeah. Distract them, perfect. We're all charming enough for that to work. That was actually a really nice thing to say. Ampit, is everything okay? I've never seen you smile like that. Seems they don't know how to take a compliment. Just like knuckles. If I'm gonna be in a casino, my poker face needs work. Okay, who's distracting the security guard? Hmm. I would say tail. Sure, I could be the distraction. Uh, I don't like the way he said that, Vito. I'm with Blaze. His delivery would shake. No, I really, I, I could do it. Sorry, buddy. I think you're better off somewhere else. Oh, uh, in that case, who should we choose? Okay, who's distracting the security guard? Damn. <laughs> uh, R Rouge. Rouge, then. Of course I'll distract them. Who could resist my feminine charm? I'm not sure how effective your charms will be on a chow. Plus, your flight might prove useful. I'm not sure you being the distraction makes sense. Oh, uh, well, fair enough. Let's think it over again. Okay. Who's distracting the security guard? Blaze, obviously. Think you could distract the guard, Blaze? In my life, I've never let a single person down. I won't falter. Great. A voice was so stoic, I have chills. Well, I trust her. Moving on. What's the distraction? Uh. I don't fucking know. What's <laughs> your budget poker chips for? That's in a rocker, so I like it a lot. That'll get the card's attention for sure. Let's move forward. With the guard distracted, Rouge, how will we get access to the card? And grab them and fly up. Pick them. Oh. 
I'll snatch, I'll snatch the access card, no problem. That KO in uniform won't notice a thing. Ciao. A ciao. Excellent! We can count on you, Rouge. Try not to take anything else from them if you can help it. No promise. The card obtained, we need to get Blaze out of there, Ampit. What's your plan? Uh... Absolutely vile! I can think of nothing worse! I would never allow such a thing in my kingdom. <laughs> God will go running immediately, I'm sure of it. Great, and with the guard distracted, but we'll all head to the elevator. And just like that, we'll all make it into the elevator. Inside, we... Done. Victory Acapella. Don't want to do that, because then they'll find us. Victory Acapella. This thing. Now that's a proper victory! Oh no, one less security measure we didn't account for. What do we do about the mechanical arms attacking from the ceiling? Tails. Tails. I should be able to disengage them, I just need some time. Well, that leads us nicely to our next question. Oh no. Tails is taking a while and the arms are tightening their grip. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> Darlings, I'm happy to say the plan is perfect. If everyone's ready, it's time to execute. I'm ready, let's begin. All right, let's see what's up that elevator. What see what's in the out. Did we do the plan? No. That was. Oh the, wait. Guess that was the plan. Oh, it's all it's all pretend anyway, isn't oh, it? That's okay. the point. I knew the plan would go off without a hitch. Couldn't have made it this far without you both. Of my gratitude. Our planning beforehand was very thorough, I must admit, and it was executed to perfection. Enough chatter. Let now we claim our real prize. I have the safe code right here on these blueprints. Let's claim our Fabergé shower egg. Do it. <laughs> oh. No question, this has got to be the safe with our treasure. Enter in the code on the blue and find out, Rouge. On it, sweetheart. Let's see. 230401. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> Here. <laughs> I have it. All right. Before anyone sees us, let's get out of here. Hold on, kiddo. We can't be so hasty. You truly really think that's all there is to this egg? No further secrets whatsoever. Rouge, spit it out. What are you hiding? Only three of these eggs were ever made, each hiding their own individual secret. No one knows the secret. Anybody who's opened one of these has never lived to tell the tale. You can open the egg. You sure can. And all of you will bear witness to its secret. Tired. <laughs> Rouge, I don't know if you should. Tough work being a voice actor. All you need to do is twist it! Click, click. Uh oh. Tick, tick, tick. Ah! Uh oh. Rouge, no one has ever lived to tell the secret. Because each egg has a bomb? I think you're onto something, kid. It sure sounds like a bomb. We need to dispose of that egg now. Dispose of it? After all our hard work? Rouge. <laughs> fine, fine. But what do we do? Where do we put this thing? That's an excellent question. What do we do with the bomb? Lock it in the safe. <laughs> oh, shit. Lock it in the safe. Is that an option? Throw and lock it in. Yeah. Eat the egg! <laughs> Quick! Put the egg back, Rouge! Oh, okay, fine. It's going back in. Huh? Hells, the safe won't lock. The door's staying open. What? Close the door and twist the dowel. I obviously am. There must be some weird way to lock the door. 
There's no other buttons or dials. How are you supposed to... Don't have time to mess with this. Think of something else. <laughs> Let Rouge kiss the egg. <laughs> <laughs> Tails, cool. Uh, um. Tails, throw that away. What does that mean? I think that's one of. I think Blaze has a. Oh. Let's open it up and different. Yeah. Spot. What do you mean by this? You know, red wire, blue wire. You gotta cut one like the movies. This isn't a movie, I bet This is real life. A point. Oh, um, cross in the elevator. Yeah, all right, down it goes. We're clearly not gonna blow up the elevator. Let's rethink this. Great idea. Stop, stop. It's clearly not working. Let's think of something else. Uh, that one. Yes. Where did you hear about chaos control? Doesn't matter. We need a chaos emerald to be able to do that. Oh, dang it. Uh. Mm, just click on all of them. <laughs> Let the, the yeah. Are you insane? Do you want us to blow up? We need to dispose of the bomb and bit that is our goal. Listen, listen, I get that, but what if the egg isn't a bomb? Wait, that's right. And bit, I think you're onto something. Huh? What's right? Spit it out, kiddo, we don't have any time. Sorry, it's just SBO did say something interesting when we quizzed him about the train's manual. Okay, um, what efficient and extremely accurate technology was installed to assist in keeping the train spotless? What part? During the event, perform a variety of tasks that are responsible for cleaning up trash and messing up. Robotic arms can also detect weapons or explosives being brought off the train. During the it was a bomb, the arms would have detected it. Those robot arms that attacked us in the elevator seem to have a lot of functions here on the train. If a bomb were brought onto the train disguised as this Fabergé shower egg, the arms would have detected it and wouldn't have allowed it on. The only other person who, would, who knows the coming and going of the train is the conductor. He surely wouldn't allow such a thing on either. So if we're out of options, I think we should wait and see what happens. Uh. Uh. Okay, we wait. Uh. Bye. Thanks so much for watching our playthrough of The Murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. Please hit subscribe as well as that bell button so you can find out when the next episode comes out. And we'll see you all in a bit. Bye.